And on Wednesday, ESU 13 hosted a free training for law enforcement and first responders to learn practical strategies for effective, fair, and safe approaches when interacting with individuals on the autism spectrum and related disabilities. 34 people representing law enforcement and first responders from across the panhandle registered for the training presented by national speaker Dennis DeBott. He has over 25 years of experience in autism and law enforcement curriculum development and training room delivery. He told KNB News that the training benefits everyone who lives here. Uh, there, there are autistic people who may have contacts with the police that are positive. Many of these are positive, some not so much. Uh, but uh, autistic people can be terrific neighbors, friends, as well as employees. There uh, is a, a growth area in employment for uh, individuals on the autism spectrum that could and does include uh, law enforcement or related uh, uh, careers. This training was designed to help law enforcement and first responders better understand individuals on the spectrum with the hope of lowering the risk and frequency of contact with public safety professionals.